<laughs> Welcome back to my channel. Today, me and Emily are going to be doing a mukbang for my channel. For my channel. So much like that. Mukbang, whatever you call it. I don't know. We have the one and the only. No. no. So we've got. I'll show you what we've got. We've got chip. Basically, have the same order, but just a little bit different. What's that? Oh, I got halloumi because I had a free green rule, so why not? Um, so we both have chip. I normally have mash when I'm in there, but takeaway mash isn't it for Nando, so. Emily has a plain butterfly. I have a peri tamer butterfly. If you've never tried peri tamer, oh my god, guys, you need to try it. So good. Have you ever tried it? Yeah, yeah. you don't have to pay for it though. And then I've made a curry barbecue yeah. and it's spicy. Oh, what did you get? And we also both get garlic bread, so just take yours. You've got to get that curry tamer sauce out, guys. So, what drink are you drinking now? Oasis. And I have a um, fizzy, fizzy like flavoured water, which is my favourite. And we both have ketchup! What are you guys are we? Literally. And then, like, my friends all get plain. But then I think there's a few of my friends that don't. So we asked some questions over on my Instagram. Make sure to go follow me over there. Um, and we also asked on our TikTok. We actually have a joint TikTok account. So I'm gonna like, I said to her, we should make a TikTok account. She should make a TikTok account. So it's called G and Amni, and we post content of just both of us. Um, and it was a bit of fun. At first it was like proper professional, like we were in a car park doing dances, like the trends. Now we literally are on there singing. Um, badly singing. So you want to go check that out. It's called G and Ami. Yeah. I never think Nando's is like a takeaway because it tastes like just mm. healthy in a way. And like, I feel like not. for a mukbang, it's like so weird because do you know what I mean? I don't feel like it's a mukbang food, but like people do Nando's like mukbangs. I don't know mukbang. Oh, mukbang. I don't know why I'm saying that mukbang. <laughs> mukbang. <laughs> Chicken. <laughs> oh. Chicken. Bye bye. Bye bye. So by the time this video is up, we will know if Emily has won anything for the TikTok Awards. First question we have is favourite movie to watch together? That's so funny because we literally just said in the car, I asked Emily if we could watch a film because for her channel, we're making brownies and um, did not feel like we can watch a film with her brownies? Mm -hmm. But what's our favourite film to watch together? I watched The Kissing Move. No, with that, with it, Trevor. Wild Child. Oh, Wild Child. Wild Child is our favourite film. To watch or Mean Girls. Or Mean Girls, or what else was there? Do you know what every movie I've never watched but everyone goes about and I know I like her? Go on. Um, Clueless. Do you know what? I, I thought that and I never actually really felt much for Clueless. Hmm. Mm. I don't know. I feel like I'd like it more now than I would when I was younger. I like Leave Leave Long, that's another one of my face. But Wild Child. Bobby Moore, bed now. Bobby Moore, bed now. I feel like if we don't know what we're gonna watch, then we'll probably end up watching our child. So McDonald's or Nando's? Nando's. Nando's. Favorite holiday? Mexico. California. Yeah. George's is Mexico. Mine's California. Oh my god. Just the best memory. Like we really, really, really want to go back. So Dad, if you're watching this. Blue. Blue. That was my favourite because I just got to like see so many things that I've seen in movies and like I went to Abbey Lee Studio and that was like what the hell. Mm. So I think like going and seeing things that I've seen all over my movies and because I was a music kid, there's a lot of big influences from music kid that lived there. So it was like mm. this is where they live, you know. And like I watched a lot of dance videos where they used to go to all the big landmarks and take pictures. So it was like yeah. I forgot about my halloumi, but mm -hmm. mm. hi there. I hate it, I hate it. Mm -hmm. Guys, you actually can't beat me. Maybe. Just on your Do you like One Direction? Yeah. I was never like a massive One Direction fan. I was more a JLS girl, like, can't lie. I was a little mix. Um, I'm a little mix, I love little mix too, but. Mm. Fun fact, I went to One Direction's concert and I was, like, I went with my friends and I literally sat there and everyone was like screaming about people sitting behind me and I was like, why is everyone shouting about these people behind me? I had no idea, genuinely no idea who these people were. Turns out, 
they ended up getting moved because there was like there was like six of them ended up having to move because everyone was like jump people were jumping over our seats trying to get pictures with these people and i was like sitting there like oh my god like, what is happening it was zoella joe sug um louise i don't i'm not sure if alva days was there it was literally all those youtubers that were like the og youtubers and i had no idea until after when i was like mm, who was that but yeah how funny is that zoella mm, she sat <laughs> behind me i didn't even know who she was and then about a year later i was queuing up for a meet and greet because just met her there Oh yeah, I had a picture. But yeah, yeah. I met Zoe when I wrapped the meeting with you. How have you been coping with lockdown? Or what have we been doing in lockdown? I've just been filming TikToks, so there's nothing much to do. Yeah, same. Um, I feel like this lockdown's worse because I don't even want to go on a walk like to get out of that. Well, I do want to, but like I can't because it's literally raining all the time. Like It's freezing, isn't it? I don't know, I just, I preferred the summer lockdown just because it was I know, and also I don't really feel what, and like, I don't, we don't know when this is going to stop, so I'm just like... I feel like the first one was quite exciting because no one's been in it before, so yeah. it was like, you know what I mean? Like, it was still bad, and I know it, that a lot of people's mental health went downhill because of it, but at the same time, people was very excited over it, and people was Not like... excited, but they were just like, oh, new, like, something new. It's been so long, like, we have literally just been in and out of these lockdowns, and like, it just feels like it's never going to end now, so it's... I feel worse this time, but like, I also, don't know... I think we're quite fortunate because work our family are nice. Mm. We have like a close bond with our family, so yeah. it's not like hard to live just with them all the time. Like, mm. Obviously, we have our moments where we're arguing, but like no. we're really fortunate that we everyone just gets on. And, like, I don't know. I just feel for people that don't have a good home life and like they're escapers, like going to school or to work or hoping everyone is feeling okay. Sending so everything I love if you're not. Peace and kisses. Um, what damn question what we've been doing? Same, I've literally just been doing TikToks. Um, FaceTime. Yeah, like literally just TikToks and like speaking to my friend, FaceTime with my friend. Um, nothing much really. But I haven't got you for another two weeks, so. I feel like I've got really distant with my friends this lockdown. Like last lockdown, I call them every night. Now, if I send to call, I just don't answer. Do what time you can't wait for? Well, if you don't follow Emily, you won't know. She's actually one of the what you, creators. Special creators. Special creators at Top Fest this year. So I will probably be there. So if anyone wants to come meet us and um, don't know, come to Top Fest, buy a ticket. Um, that's something we really look forward to. I feel like it's such a build up for this Top Fest because it literally keeps getting cancelled, but like. When it maybe finally happens, it will be unreal. Yeah, they'll even move the date or they'll refund the tickets. So I'm looking forward to like just being able to travel mm -hmm. because there's a lot of things that I've been invited to go to and now it's all been cancelled. Georgia has a secret boyfriend. Yeah, she does. <sighs> Come on, I can't put that in. No, I do not have a secret boyfriend. Would you ever get another dog? I would actually yeah. get another dog. I want an Italian greyhound so bad. I think it's like a mini Fanta. Mm. And like they stay smallish and they're very playful. Mm. I would love them to We will get another dog eventually, but we have bad luck with three dogs. Yeah, we never want to get three dogs. So every time we've had three dogs, one of our dogs has a savvy paw. So yeah, we're not going to get one anytime soon, I don't think. Um, but we will eventually one day, but yeah, I don't know when that'll be. I want to get a sausage dog for my 21st, which is next year. So maybe I'll ask them that. I'm gonna get a sausage dog for my 21st and graduation joint present. I don't think that'll let me answer. Best cinema snack, wrong answers only. Cereal. <laughs> I'm thinking about it too much. I can't think of anything. I like fruit or something. Who was your least favourite character from Cross Girl and what did you not like about them? Deroda. Your least favourite? I love her. I mean, never finished it, guys. She's a fake gossip girl. But I'm like, I don't even, I didn't like it that much. She picked it up so much. Like, oh my god, I love the gossip girl. And it literally stopped on like 10 minutes. What age do you want kids? 23. Oh god. I'm literally 23 in three years. That makes me sick. I don't know. I really don't like putting dates on it. Like, it happens, it happens. Yeah. I don't really put dates on things, but like, when I'm financially stable, and I can afford to have one, and I have a nice 
boyfriend that I actually like. <laughs> that is gonna be a long time in guys. When are our birthdays? Mine is February 27th, 2001. Mine's August 30th, 2007. How many times have you moved house? Two. You haven't? Oh yeah, once. She said moved once, I've moved twice. But the first time I moved, I was literally like a year. So I don't, a year. <laughs> a year, I was one. Have you ever thought about going vegan? <laughs> That's very um. I eat too many vegan chips. Um, personally not vegan. I don't think I could be vegan. I thought about going vegetarian. Would you ever go on Ibiza? <laughs> yeah. The guys, I really needs to go on Ibiza because Genuinely, oh, the, the video she just put up on Sunday. Um, go watch that and you'll see why Emily would literally be voted for every child because it's hilarious. Yeah, I'll do it. Why not? <laughs> Memories. Have either of you broken a bone? Yes, I broke all five of my toes. <laughs> and my foot on an escalator. <laughs> oh, that's really funny. I broke my nose on a water slide. <laughs> on a water slide. Because you're just dumb and she decides to turn back and you're dumb to put your foot on new new wrestle. I didn't think to. Yeah, that was a pain. Stop speaking like Alfie. I don't know it. Mm, who do you miss the most in lockdown? Family. Yeah, my grandparents. Just like when all our family get together and I've been like, mm. and then, like Jackies and stuff. Yeah, like all our cousins. I don't know, especially because we didn't have Christmas, like we haven't got, all got together in such a long time, it's just tired. But if you weren't influencers, what would your dream job be? Being a dancer. I mean, I wouldn't count myself an influencer yet, but I don't want to be an influencer. Like, I do, I'd love to be an influencer on the side, but for now, I'd love to go into like business or something. So, like, PR, marketing, social media manager, things like that. That's where I'm like hoping to head um, and then do social media on the side. So, that's probably my dream job. Or, like, I want to start my own business. So we have now finished our food and we're going to finish this video here. So thank you so much for watching. Please like, comment and subscribe. I will see you in the next video. Bye. Bye.